This is ABC 7 News at 6. I'm Dr. Gina Dell coming up, providing art to help patients and families heal. Well, up next, the healing power of art. Find out how Bay Area artists are contributing so much to the world of medicine. It feels like home. It feels warm, not just a sterile wall. And tonight, Dr. Dina Dell, a special ABC 7's salute. You know, for most healthcare organizations, the problem is always a serious lack of money. And in tight budgets, artwork, not a high priority. Yet research shows that art can help heal both the body and the spirit. In tonight's ABC 7 salute, Dr. Dina Dell looks at a man and an organization that are providing art for healing. Have a multitude. There are paintings, oh, prints, drawings. This unlikely looking storage locker is a treasure trove of art, both originals and reproductions. And Angus White is a curator, Pied Piper and Fairy Godmother all rolled into one. That's, That's nice. Pretty. Yes. Very nice. This very is a nice. man ray. Very it's a bit like Christmas for Alexandra Morgan and her helpers who get to choose whatever they want to hang on the walls of Family House, a new center established to help families of sick children. That is such a yes. That is so great. One by one, the group selects artwork that cheers or soothes the spirit. Angus White and others have gathered all this art together as part of an organization called Art for Healing. What's amazing about Art for Healing is how much a healthcare organization has to pay to get this art. Not a penny. That's right, all of this art absolutely free. There's no charge to the healthcare facility or to the participating organizations. We have a couple of um, major individual donors and we do a benefit every year. Wow. Let's have that one. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Yay! Good. Wow. Angus is quick to point out most of the art is donated by collectors or the artists themselves. At Family House, the art goes up on the bare walls just as families begin moving in. Family House provides free housing for seriously ill children and their parents who are being treated at UCSF. Joni is typical. My babies are born here at UCSF at 27 and a half weeks, full terms 40 weeks. Her preemie twins were born 13 weeks early, and she lives three hours away. Family House has become a haven for her and her mother while she waits for her babies to go home. The artwork has made a big difference to her peace of mind. When you come into a room, it feels like home. It feels warm, not just a sterile wall. It was a complete gift that created a beautiful environment for our families. Art for Healing has had a major impact at UCSF's Langley Porter Psychiatric Facility as well. This is a painting that many patients feel uh, is very soothing to them. Donated artwork fills lobby walls and lines of corridors throughout the facility, and the staff says artwork has become essential to patient well-being. Art is very important in terms of affecting people's mood and their behavior. Angus is, and Art for Healing is providing something that is of enormous value. Art ups, uplifts every human spirit. And so we salute Angus White and the other contributors who've made Art for Healing such a powerful force for so many people. To donate art or money, we have a link on our website. Just log on to abc7news.com and click on Dr. Dina Dell. You should donate something. Your work is beautiful. Yeah, that, yeah. Their work is a whole lot better, though. No, That's no, the problem no, with that. Don't good. be modest. He's but, quite an artist. But,